Uh, is she a witch? Yes. Yeah, it's more like a bit. No! <laughs> <laughs> she, she, probably, she probably liked that. Oh. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So these guys play a good amount. Both of them are 10 Aeon. They 10 um, a Wednesday weekly Gotham. So both on the island. They, they play each other. Oh, I forget to use Long Island. Yeah, a lot of people do forget. <laughs> Until, like, he pulls up to the local and is like, yo, I'm here to collect. And, and Amnirolis has beaten him before. I can see right there that stock. Right there, really, really good um, early stock, early edge guard. Yeah. Oh, no. Make it kind of quick work. Okay. Dude, I'm not really sure why he countered it instead of trying to push his advantage. Or just, like, so maybe he thought he game. was going to press a button, but Amnirolis just delayed his action. Okay, that's smart. I guess countering the witches would great, give a lot of advantage. That burst off of the parry was immaculate. Okay, tried to two, get the two frame right there. Nice. Oh, a bit late. Both of the defensive, but getting it? Yeah, if you, mm. if Mr. E missed that tech, it would probably would have been like, not stock, but, but like, like 90%. Yeah, very bad position for him. Trying to land versus Bayo. Trying to land to get ABK in your face. Not, not a fun time. Yeah, you're going to have a bad time. <laughs> All right, good wait. Usually, uh, Amarillo is better than most battles, not ABKing off the ledge immediately. Yeah, that was a bit of patient. Very wonderful counter, too. Okay. Oh, oh just a bit no. early. But got away with it. Double hit from that there. Double hit privilege, yes, sir. Bale's Bale's new favorite thing. Yo, how did that scoop? That's scoop, that scoop better than my Cold Stone ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I didn't program this character. All I know is that I got scooped a lot when I was fighting Amarillo's er earlier. That up tilt has it's very deceptive in range. Woo! Yeah. Okay. I mean, see, it's just, I've been forgetting that Bayonetta is light, and that Lucina just has the power to eviscerate socks. Yeah, no, everybody acts like Lucina can't kill. With side B. Yeah, with side B, with fair, with bear. She... She oh. was the original nice back air character. <laughs> <laughs> it's just that I'm so used to seeing characters like Roy and well, main, Roy. Yeah. <laughs> the sword uh, people with side B. Really just that. The sword people with side B that kills you at like 60. Roy. It's like, oh yeah, Lucina kills me at one, 120. Yeah, you know. I, uh, Consistently. Consistently, all the time. And she has no problem racking up all that damage either. Yeah, and as you see right here, like, I'm gonna realize can't kill. With Bayo, like, Mr. He's at 160 and 80% already done. 104 now. You quick up, you had a shield, send him back to the send him back to the corner. He was really good stage control right now. Not like giving Amarillo really a chance to play this that's game. A, but yeah, they buffed not. that. <laughs> they did. I feel like that's like a useless buff, but like. No, so it's really good for catching like neutral get ups and like rolls. So it actually kills at a fairly like good percent. So if you catch them at like 120 ish, or like almost all characters, it's like, yo. You're actually dead here. Okay. So that's not okay, so I'm capping that. It's not that bad. Yeah, it's not that bad. Huh. Especially for a character like Bay who has no problem like tacking all this damage yeah. onto you. So it, like, it gets really scary. It's like, man, I gotta be good at my mix up which I gotta gotta, gotta be also good at your SCI too. Dude. I learned that today. Yeah. I'm really looking from zero to sixty and I'm like, am I playing Smash Bros? Uh what? Check the disc. Am I, am Is that I? a gamepad? <laughs> <laughs> what's, going, what's going on? What's going on? Why don't, okay. I, why don't I see Sephiroth on the screen? <laughs> <laughs> All right, taking it right back to the battlefield immediately. He's starting off with another explosive start. 52% already on the board. Yeah, and it seems like the second he got the start, like, I'm the realist. Like, I've been having problems, like, fighting. And maybe not as much problems as I thought before. With this turnaround. Big damage right now. I would have said it's uncontested, but right now he's in a really good spot. Hello? Okay. Hello? Hello? Okay. <laughs> he thinks he has some mix. <laughs> he thinks. He thinks he mixed himself up with how much how much stuff he was doing over there. He's like, yo, I got the biggest brain here, but I'm just going to Dolphin Slash. <laughs> Taking a quick easy start. Nice. Maybe up uh, well, heel side to cast a tech in place. Why does he have two? Side B, that's that's privileged. What a beautiful. All right, there. Yeah, Mr. E. A lot of good, a lot of knowledge from E in this match right now. Choosing a lot of times just to wait for Bayonetta to like do an action. Just you know, Bayo disadvantage. Disadvantage is not that good. So she's gonna like throw out like a lot of air dodges and 
what I'm looking for. Which time? Yeah, definitely. He is scouting that out a bunch. Oh! Just barely missing. Fading yeah. it out. Yeah, getting right there. Oh, this, this could be huge. This could be huge! Yeah, that's it. Oh no, alive, but still a horrible position. Ah, he flopped it. Down Ezra, smash? But no, okay. I'm just letting him come back for free. Like, yeah, probably wasn't like too short about the re-grab position. Would the Dolphin Slash have hit him if he went for a down smash? Uh, maybe, depending on the position. But I don't think he was in position for that. And you saw how the jab just killed right there. Yeah. Definitely, definitely a good move. 140 was a good amount of rage on him. Sheesh. Yeah, and we both said Bale was really good at attacking up damage. Like I said, right here, this would be even oh. game, but nice. Yeah, nice one. Caught on world sleeping at the wheel. Said you gain slumber. <laughs> All right, tagging on more percent. And you see, Mister, now playing a bit more patient. Bail, not Definitely. the character known to go in and having the best of approach options. So she really just like kind of like Danny, where it's like you approach Bail. Yeah. And you saw him like roll four times. So this roll is kind of stale. <laughs> <laughs> Next one is not going to give you much invincibility. Yeah. He going in. Yeah. So that just took forever. It kind of did. <laughs> <laughs> but it took forever, but he is now finding himself with stage control and in a really good position. Or kind of. I'm really going to be running some route. Yeah. Just trying to find something. 81% done on Mr. E. But I'm going to realize on the last stock in 98, 111. Has to find a way to get back to the ground carefully without putting himself in a bad okay. spot. Yeah, no DI in this time. Ooh, really good scout, but he aired out just in time. So what's the option? How are we going to find a way back to stage safely? Yeah, not going to take it just yet. Both of them right here still feeling each other out. Neither of them want to push, especially not Amarillo. This is his. This is what? Tournament life on the stock. Yeah. Oh, man. This is not looking good. Not good at all. You know, I feel like he's playing so patient. I feel like with like, the amount of times Amaro just gets up and just get up shield, you think he would just pull through with like a shield breaker or something like that. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> but shield breaker is kind of committal and falling up here. Yeah, it's going to do it. <laughs> what a way to take the stock. Jesus Christ. So the idea